Maybe the delivery thing actually needs to touch the sidewalk. No? Fuck, I have no idea. I mean, I would love for it to work, but it doesn't seem to be working. And actually, I think Detention Center X is just... We can't even get our new prisoners because deliveries are so broken. Can it stop now? No? Maybe it's this door. Maybe this door needs to be dismantled. And maybe we just need to replace it with a normal door. Maybe it's too much to have a locked door on the outside. We'll try it. We'll see how that works. Can it work? Oh, who's this? It's fucking Akula's lawyer. Can you believe that? Holy shit. What's he want? Get out of here. There's nothing to see here. There's no problems at the detention center. X, you don't need to do an investigation or anything. Don't worry about it. It'll be fine. Honestly, it'll be fine. Um, can we get rid of some of these walls then? Maybe, can we get rid of, like, these walls? Make it, like, a bit of a more open... <sighs> Fucking trucks, come on. We need some deliveries. Stat. We, our kitchen staff are just milling around doing nothing. And look at all this. What's going on? Nobody can do anything. Are, are there deployment problems? What's it? Oh, no. They, can't, they couldn't get there because the whole place has been locked down. The whole place has been locked down because of the dangerous outbursts that the minimum security uh, prisoners have been having recently. It's made Detention Center X a completely unsafe place to come to and look at this there's not enough solitary cells so look they're having to bring all of these uh, minimum security prisoners into the uh, maximum security or medium security oh look they won't even shut the solitary door there's a riot underway great <laughs> how has this fucking happened i don't get it all right how do i get it's an emergency fine we're having an emergency. We want the riot police to turn up. Great. Thank you, riot police. Here they come. Oh, no. Look, they can't make it into... <laughs> they can't make it into the prison. <laughs> Why can't the riot police make it into the prison? How is Detention Center X just... Descended into complete and utter chaos all of a sudden? Look at what's happening. <laughs> what? what in the fuck is happening? Riot police, please. Just look at... We're calling you all in. Come on! There's plenty of fucking room! Why do you- why won't you stop? What has happened? Uh, I mean, deliveries. This is- this is all based on deliveries not working. No food arrived to the prison. <laughs> no fucking food has arrived to the prison. And that's why these people are so angry. Look, I bet you a million bucks. It's food, yeah. No food has made it to the prison. Nobody's been able to cook up some amazing meals. Deliveries are just completely fucking broken right now. I mean, we get to listen to this cool music and stuff, but I don't think there's any way around this. Is there any way around uh, this delivery thing? Fucking where is deliveries even? Apparently we have two delivery areas. I'm sure that we do not have two delivery areas. Is there another delivery area I don't know about? Or is it maybe just like hidden in here somehow? Okay, now we have... Ah, okay. Finally. It looks like the... <laughs> Somehow. Okay, there's food now arriving in Detention Center X. It might be a bit late. Uh, it looks like... Holy shit. Uh, does that mean that we can now actually call in the riot police? We're calling them all in. Holy shit, all three of them. Let's get the paramedics in as well. Is there any fires? Okay, there's no fires. Uh, but it looks like the riot police... <laughs> <laughs> the riot police are here <laughs> in the deliveries area. Okay, riot police, we want you in here. Uh, uh, no, we want you in in here. Yeah, okay. These riot police will have you in here as well. And let's get these riot police in here. And holy shit, this is exciting. Let's get some paramedics down here, I guess. There's a whole bunch of people just bleeding out in the, in the yard. Paramedics, can we get you down in here somewhere maybe? Like here? No? Paramedics? Paramedics do not want to be deployed. Uh, they seem to be making their way in though. Oh shit, look at that. Okay. Uh, the riot situation. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> Fuck me. I mean, come on. The, the, okay. Let's have a recap of what happened there. We had a delivery area in here, okay? And this is exactly what's happened. The delivery area was in here. But... The delivery area was also underneath this brick wall, and this brick wall, and, crucially, this door. 
Uh, there wasn't enough space for this one square of deliveries to receive all of the shit that needed to come into Detention Center X. Uh, and instead of using this big fucking delivery area here, they were trying to cram it all into this one little square. Which of course was not working. Uh, so no food turned up to the prison for... I don't know... A week? <laughs> Everybody got really fucking pissed off about that, and now we've had to deploy riot police, which actually can fucking go home now. Uh, the paramedics will hang on to, because uh, we need to clean up this absolute shitstorm. Um, we may recover from this, though. Look at deliveries now seems to be sorted out. It seems to be okay now. Look at this. Look at all these fucking food trays. We've got all these food trays delivered here uh, with uh, no food to, to serve any of it on. Uh, it looks like Mark Fletcher, uh, who seems to be, to me, somehow, like the key component to all of this shit happening. He was the first person to actually enact any violence inside the minimum security portion of uh, Detention Center X. Is now in solitary confinement for 6 hours and 10 minutes. <laughs> he's got a long time to think about it. He's injured. He's pretty mad. I think he might be taking a piss on the floor. He's complaining about food. He's got to wait a little while longer before he actually gets any. Okay, look, the danger rating is now slowly dropping. Holy shit. Man, that was pretty intense. I thought for a minute there, I thought the whole thing had just gone to hell and we'd lost the whole prison. Thankfully, that's not the case. Uh, it looks like we missed our initial uh, prisoner intake of medium security. Oh, look at this guy. He's just in full fight mode. Look at this. He's not taking any chances. Look, he's doing the rest of his patrols in full fight mode. Fantastic. Uh, this is going to be great, though. Look at this. We actually have our long-term investment funds turning up in the next 40 minutes, which is fantastic. Uh, we might be able to manufacture some license plates. It looks like we've actually made, like, one or two. We've made some progress on this. We've actually made 6%. I don't know if we've actually exported any. Be interesting to see. License plates? No, <laughs> there's no, there's no thing here that says license plates, uh, unfortunately. All right. Well, uh, we've done it. <laughs> we've gotten 16 grand uh, for that catastrophic, uh, catastrophic failure. Sorry. Uh, I think this is probably going to be the next one. Look at this. We're going to assign two dog handlers and two armed guards on patrol as well. This is part of the governmental security ratings. We get a 15 grand advance payment and a 15 grand completion bonus. Not bad. We can definitely use 15 grand uh, in the short term and also another 15 grand in the long term. Uh, we have 11 prisoners arriving, which actually for once should be able to arrive. Uh, on t uh, sorry, I meant to say uh, not on time. They, they'll actually be able to make it into the goddamn fucking prison. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, and this should now work as well. Uh, I dismantled that thinking that that was part of the problem. It doesn't seem to be the problem. And actually now Detention Center X is once again secure. And look at these guys in their uh, yellow prison outfits. Holy shit. We got Jason Voorhees. We've got The Zone. Calzone. <laughs> Warren Weiner. Lovegrove is back! <laughs> Simon Lovegrove, at the age of 25, has ditched his sunglasses, has somehow bleached his skin, uh, and has grown a bit more hair, I think, possibly. Put on a bit of weight, but he's back. He's back to serve his time in Detention Center X after his famous escape all that time ago. Fuck, I can't believe that nobody actually escaped um, during that whole scene. It just shows things are a lot more secure than they were. We've got some injuries, and actually the paramedics can now fuck off. There you go, paramedics. Get the hell out of here. We don't need you anymore. Uh, fucking Cisco and Ebert here are more than capable of handling uh, these injured people. Just need somebody to actually take them into here. Look at this. Come on. Take them. We need to search and... Oh, shit. No. Not Jordan Knight. Not Jordan Knight from the new kids on the block. Say it ain't so. He's waiting, searching... Um, what's he done recently? Destruction, attack staff, serious injury, and found weapons. Unbelievable. Jordan Knight, you no longer get to go in the wacky cell. Jordan Knight, we're reassigning you to this cell instead, you son of a bitch. We're going to find somebody who didn't cause all sorts of goddamn problems uh, during that big riot. What the hell is happening here? Are people fucking pissed already? Say it ain't so. Look at this. Bacon is on the menu. 
I hear banging. Who's in here banging around? Whoever it is, I'm telling you, it's a one-way ticket to solitary. I'm not having it. Oh no, it's not banging. It's a uh, Garvey. <laughs> Garvey's operating a saw. <laughs> okay. Sorry about that, prisoners. Uh, I was wrongfully accusing you of causing a ruckus when actually it was just Garvey making license plates. I, I fucking can't believe it. Look at this. <laughs> We've got two license plates built. Can we export them? I would love to export them. I'm really keen on getting this workshop up and running so that we can make more money. Holy crap, that to me is just like the most fantastic thing. Look, you gotta love this. Look at these fucking deliveries. Look at this. What the hell is going on? Who is this? Who the fuck is this? And why is he in black? He's thinking about freedom. He's gonna be escorted to a cell. His name is Torch. Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark, RN. G. Dali. At the age of 23. Look at that. What a face. Holy shit. He, he looks very attractive. Too attractive, maybe, to be incarcerated uh, as such. Okay, um, can we start bringing some of these guys into the fucking... Come on, what's going on? Medium security? You guys ready? No? You want want to escort? Okay, finally. Looks Finally, it looks like some of our medium security prisoners are making uh, the long road into... We need more guards. Look at this. We're going to have three more guards to help out transport some of these new prisoners. I don't know what these guys are fucking doing. They all seem to be... Um, fixated on spending every available second in the day inside the minimum security block of detention center x instead of actually transporting all of these medium security prisoners to their new digs uh, such as this guy who's this it's fucking gareth waits gareth waits is going to occupy the first cell in cell block b look at that he's got the best one uh, oh shit, he doesn't even want to spend a single second in there because it's currently yard time. So look at this, he's making his way out into the yard. He's just arrived at cell block B, detention center X, and he's going to mill around in the yard for a couple of hours during yard time uh, and then figure out uh, the other kind of shit that he might like to get up to at some point in time. God knows. Um, do we want to have some guys helping out in this kitchen? Probably do. Space for six. Oh, shit. Get on it. Yeah. Wait. You want to be the first guy to work in the kitchen? Nope. He doesn't. He's going back to his cell. He's had enough. <laughs> He's fucking pissed. All right, Waits. That's your prerogative. You just do that. All right. Here they all come. Look at this. They're all coming in now. We've got this guy with his gang bandana. It's Cal's speedster zone. <laughs> Cal zone. He's uh, been convicted of aggravated vehicle theft. And armed robbery. He's going to serve 26 years of his life inside Detention Center X. Uh, his biography states that he was arrested for armed robbery and death by dangerous driving. Fantastic. After robbing a mobility scooter shop using a sock filled with boiled sweets, he made a speedy getaway on one of the mobile scooters, running down a policeman who tried to stop him. He has an ex-wife at the age of 32 who probably is not going to want to hear from him from one of these phone booths and uh, is most definitely not going to visit his wretched ass in the visitation center because currently we have no visitation sorted out for medium security prisoners. This is all MinSec and that's the way it's going to stay because holy shit, we had a close call with that riot. Uh, it was interesting to see though, I've never actually had a riot before uh, and I think we handled it quite well. Well, as well as it could be handled, uh, considering the whole uh, delivery fiasco uh, that we just had. That was pretty bad. Uh, but hey, we managed to get cell block B up and running. We've got a whole bunch of prisoners turning up uh, to live uh, the rest of their days in cell block B. It looks like they're having bacon for dinner. Just bacon. It's not bad. And it looks like somebody... Uh, fuck. Fuck you, Tom Darley. What, you fucking tried to steal a fucking power tool? What the hell is your fucking problem? Who does that? Where do you even fucking hide that? Where do you hide that? Honestly, there's nowhere to hide that. Uh, okay, great. Well, we're still progressing. <laughs> Jesus, that was a close one. I had a little bit of a mini heart attack, and I probably now need to go find a uh, dark room to lay down in. Uh, we had a riot. We finished cell block B. 
Uh, we did some uh, jigging and poking and managed to sort a couple of things out. Uh, we'll be back, though. Next session, we'll, uh, we'll concentrate on the staff area. We'll get security and stuff set up. We'll get some CCTV cameras. We'll get armed guards. We'll get some dog patrols as well so that we can sniff out drugs on all these bastards. We're going to definitely get a dog walking up and down here because these Minsec guys are known for it. They get all of their uh, candy, uh, their nose candy. I uh, almost said candy fluff. Uh, their, their regular supply of nose candy delivered into the minimum security wing of the prison so that they could just, um, you know, live it up in their cell, listening to, like, awesome uh, Devo and uh, Duran Duran music on their Sony Walkmans inside their cells. Medium security uh, part of the cell, uh, cell block is not much of a problem, though. Uh, there's no Duran Duran in there. There's no Devo in there. In fact, there's no music whatsoever. There's no talking. Uh, and actually, sometimes we just switch the lights off, too. Uh, these guys have to have quiet time at all times because we don't want to aggravate them and get them out there uh, busting each other's noggins left, right, and center out in the yard or uh, making their way into the minimum security wing and busting everybody else's noggins because these guys are dangerous. These guys are fucking dangerous. Look at this. Like Dan Beswick, death by dangerous driving. Nine fucking years. Holy shit. He's in the right place. What about Simon Cowell here? Five years for rioting. Son of a bitch. You just missed one, Simon. We just had one. Uh, and this guy's been sentenced to four years for violent disorder. Holy crap. Okay, these guys are all in the right place. This one's ultra secure. All right, excellent. Well, there you go. Detention Center X. Still plodding along. We're still getting there. We're still progressing. Uh, we'll be back. We'll sort out some new stuff. Um, I definitely want to make Cell Block C the maximum security uh, wing of the prison. And I want to get a... Uh, electric chair set up as well. I don't know if you can actually execute prisoners, but holy shit, I'd be up for doing that. Or, or at least seeing it happen. Uh, or at least even just getting a really cool um, electric chair uh, chamber. Execution chamber? I almost said torture chamber. It's not quite a torture chamber though, is it? It's an ex execution chamber. Jesus Christ. Okay, great. Well, as usual, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you next time!